I'm Billy Harris. You're hanging with Harris and my good friend Jason Aroni at Superba Snack Bar in Venice Beach. You're just smiling. How are you, Jason? I'm hanging with Harris. You are hanging with Harris. So what's the quick what's the quick journey of you? How do you end up here in Venice Beach? What's the story? Uh, Disneyland <laughs> via New York City via Venice. Boom, and we're here. And that's your 20-year cooking career, right? More or less. More or less, which is great. We're a few blocks from the beach, but you're doing a lot of pasta doing what you do best, right? Or yeah. what you like to do best. So. Doodles, pasta, snacks, a lot of different riffs on classics uh, along the lines of fried chicken, uh, things like that. Where does the name Superba come from? Where does all this... Uh, there's actually a street called Superba in Venice. Uh, it also had a couple different riffs like French Superb and... Uh, ah, French Superb. You know, because we're also kind of super bad. We are kind of super bad. <laughs> but it's not really, I mean, would you consider your own restaurant just an Italian restaurant? Not really. We, we're definitely not Italian. Yeah. Uh, we, you know, we emulate some things from Italy, but you know, it's more or less a take on, you know, a journey of what my culinary career has been. Sure. What are we going to do here? What do we got? I see some dough. Today we're going to make uh, our most pop one of our most popular items, which is a short rib ravioli, which comes with espresso and vincotto. And what's vincotto? Vincotto is, uh, it's like a pressing of balsamic vinegar. It's a little bit sweeter, not as assertive. Okay. Really nice accent for beef. So I'm going to cut off a piece of this dough right here. I'm going to push this out a little bit. All right, gets a little pressing here right away. A little flour. A little flour. Da, 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 da. Let's try not to get it on your jacket. It's okay. For I'm sure. going to let you push that through first. Oh, this is, this is the thing? This is the thing. Go on ahead. We're going to put that through about seven or eight times till we get down to our desired. And this is what you guys, does someone have this job every night here just to oh, yes. turn and burn like this? Full time Now job. we change the setting, go from zero to one. Zero or to one. All, oh, this is a whole process. One more time. Go ahead. So this is number one, and we're going to rock it out all the way through seven. This is going to be our strip that you and I are going to play with today. Got it. Got it. Get, so off, all the, get, all, get off all the ugly nasties. We get tight, I'm watching you do this here. little pasta. We cook the short rib for 24 hours, nice, slow, and low. Sure. Take the broth, reduce it, and add this broth right back into the short ribs with Parmesan and garlic. So it's super flavorful, number one. And then, uh, you know, it's just like a super concentrated piece of beef sure. that's uh, formed inside of these raviolis. So I want you to just take your finger, put them in between the meat right there. Just a dab of water just on the side? Just a dab of water. I don't put any egg in mine because there's already egg in the dough. This is just a folding technique. So it's just this? Yep. We'll Spoon. push it down. I don't know if I'm doing that right, but it looks right. As long as it's pushed down nice and tight. And then we're going to do this. Oh, now you're doing the formal roll. Fold. You tuck it under. And then we're just cutting these and then we're cooking this up and that's it? That's it. That's that easy. I mean, it's pasta. That's it. Boom. <laughs> We're going to drop this, Yep. our water right now. A little pasta water? A little pasta water. Any a little big bit of... secrets there or just salt and water? Uh, just salt and water. <laughs> All right. Hopefully not to burn myself. Yeah, try not to burn By the splashing yourself. water. Drop it in there. We're going to let that cook And a that's bit. going in for seconds, literally? Just until it floats. Got it. That's going to go in there. And that is? This is just butter. <laughs> just? Just some butter. <laughs> just, <laughs> just, just a little bit of butter. And, and a little pasta water. Now that's a big trick. A lot of great Italian cooks. Well, and now you're making pasta, not Italian cooks. But they really use the salt and water, right? That really is. That's all you need. That's the whole thing. Cook it out in the pasta water and all the butter so it gets all that nice flavor. Oh, yeah. So we're going to hit it with just a little bit of cheese. Oh, we're adding just a little, little bit of cheese onto a little bit of butter? Yeah. So, I mean, the pasta is just soaking all that up, right? Yeah, this with is, it. yeah, because like all the starch from the pasta is going to come out into it. It's going to thicken it right. up. Take a little bit of sea salt here. Use a little sea salt. Nice and beautiful, nice and glazy, nice and thick. It really looks Cheese amazing. Cheese is nice and melted. You ready? Yeah, oh, I'm ready to watch the whole thing. There I got my go. fork ready. Right. We're just gonna put that right onto that plate. Pasta's going to the plate. Just then like you got espresso. A little bit of espresso over the top. Love the espresso factor to it. So this is short rib ravioli. Espresso. Espresso. Vincotto. Vincotto. With like a Parmesan butter. A Parmesan butter. I've always done uh, espresso with lamb. And, I and why is that? Just if you think it bring, helps bring up the flavor? Well, there's like a Middle Eastern thing, coffee and lamb. I feel like beef sells better than lamb, so put it with the beef instead, and it actually worked out really well. Is there anything else I should do except stick my fork in there right I now? I think that you should eat that. I'm gonna. I cannot describe how good that dish is. Short rib ravioli, superb snack bar, Venice Beach, Jason Roney, hanging with Harris Hang yet with again. Harris. Thank you so much. When you're in Venice, come here. See you real soon.